Well, I was sharing uh, a big, an important part of my work, which is trying to understand domestic violence, sexual assault, sexual harassment, and, and, and that whole range of issues as men's issues, not as women's issues that some good men help out with. And I was trying to articulate how the language that we use to talk about this issue, these issues, keeps us thinking about it as a women's concern, as a women's problem. And until we get more men involved at every level, I think we're just, honestly, we're just cleaning up after the fact because men are the ones who are committing the, the vast majority of the violence. Men control a lot of the power in our society and until we have more men who are willing to look inward and also willing to be leaders and speaking out on this stuff uh, and working with women on this, not against them, um, you know, I, I don't think we have much hope for, for the transformation that's necessary. And I talked about other forms of abuse and violence in our society, both men's violence against women, but also men's violence against other men, and how they're all embedded in the same system, and that gender is at the heart of that system. So I, I shared examples of that. I showed clips from my films, and well, mine and other people's films, and um, we had a lot of interaction, a lot of, you know, because that's an important part of my work is, is just to stimulate dialogue, not just present ideas but actually have a, a dialogue and so that we do that as well. I think overall I think it's important that young men and young women hear men talking about this stuff publicly, not just interpersonally but on a, on a stage with a lot of people in the room. It's important I think just opening up space for dialogue and, and that they can see that you can be a strong man. Both women and men can see that you can be a strong man and challenge some of the traditional ideas about manhood in the culture. Some people who are defensive want to think this is a male bashing, but it's not. I don't think, if anybody walks out of here thinking they, I was bashing men, I think they're checked out intellectually and emotionally. A lot of people stayed for quite a long time, so I think people are, I think a lot of people are ready to hear and ha have dialogue about these issues. My um, hope is that s these kind of lectures are, uh, are a spark and a stimulus for further engagement rather than the end of it. So that's what I hope.